These busy cities are among the 40 works of Bethany Hanfield at the Summerland Art Gallery. They're made by manipulating colored beeswax, the process known as encaustic, a very hands-on art form. And I really like that because you can carve into it, you can layer it, you can, you know, stick things into it, and it's just, it's so tactile, you know, it's just, you can really get your teeth into it. <laughs> Bethany is truly a mixed media artist. She's been a film editor, worked with acrylics, watercolor, ink, and graffiti pens. But six years ago, she took a shine to encaustic. All different kinds of crafts my whole life. I've always been a crafty person, but when I found encaustic, it really stuck, it took off, and I just really found a passion. One of her favorites here, she calls Junior and the Twins. And yes, those are real insects in the painting. The bugs are so sweet. I just really have a soft spot for them. A little blue man, a yet unnamed character, appears in a number of the works. And be it bugs, bottle caps, or car parts, anything goes for Bethany. Yes, any, nothing is sacred from being stuck in wax. <laughs> so my niece and nephew are always finding things on the side of the road, and here, Auntie, here, and my parents too, when they do their, their road trips, and they'll, they'll bring me home bags of little things they found on the road, and I'm notorious for walking around with a little sandwich bag when I go out for walks, and ooh, I'll spy something, and you know, in the bag it goes, and then in the painting it goes. And, I, and in a way I feel too, it's kind of like it's rescuing things, you know, a piece of rusted metal or an, an old bottle cap or an old railway nail or, you know, these old kind of like, you know, uh, rusted out keys, things like that. It's keeping them from the landfill and it's, it's making them beautiful again. I think one of the main things I'd like people to take away from this show is just really thinking about how they interact with their environment and maybe kind of think about, you know, the disposability of certain things. You know, we're so used to being a throwaway culture and, I don't know, maybe thinking about how you can repurpose some of the things in your life so it doesn't end up in the garbage or the landfill. But, you know, anybody be can be creative, you know, and I think that everybody has something that's valid to say. It's nice to be able to just break out of the box and, and paint what you want. Busy Cities and the Things Unseen, an exhibit of encaustic and acrylic paintings by Bethany Hanfield continues through November 17th at the Summerland Art Gallery on Main Street. I don't know, don't be afraid, art's fabulous, come and check it out. <laughs> you might learn something new. You might find out you like something you never thought you'd like before. For Go Okanagan, I'm Wayne McDougall in Summerland.